Hello, welcome to IT New. In this video, we will learn about CCNA. Before we begin, please subscribe to the channel to help us make more videos like this. Alright, let's begin. What three application layer protocols are part of the TCP IP protocol suite? Choose three. The choices are A. ARC B. DHCP C. DNS D. FTP E. NET F. PPP The answers are B. DHCP C. DNS D. FTP DNS, DHCP, and FTP are all application layer protocols in the TCP IP protocol suite. ARP and PPP are network access layer protocols, and NAT is an internet layer protocol in the TCP IP protocol suite. Which name is assigned to the transport layer PDU? The choices are A. Bits B. Data C. Frame D. Packet E. Segment The answer is E. Segment the PDUs are named according to the protocols of the TCP IP suite. Data, the general term for the PDU used at the application layer. Segment, transport layer PDU. Packet, network layer PDU. Frame, data link layer PDU. Bits, a physical layer PDU used when physically transmitting data over the medium. What process involves placing one PDU inside of another PDU? The choices are A. Encapsulation B. Encoding C. Segmentation D. Flow control The answer is A. Encapsulation. When a message is placed inside of another message, this is known as encapsulation. On networks, encapsulation takes place when one protocol data unit is carried inside of the data field of the next lower protocol data unit. For the TCP IP protocol suite, what is the correct order of events when a telnet message is being prepared to be sent over the network? The choices are The IP header is added The TCP header is added The Ethernet header is added The Telnet formatted data is provided to the next layer The answers are, first, the Telnet formatted data is provided to the next layer. Second, the TCP header is added. Third, the IP header is added. Fourth, the Ethernet header is added. Refer to the exhibit. Server B is attempting to contact host A. Which two statements correctly identify the addressing that server B will generate in the process? Choose two. The choices are A. Server B will generate a packet with the destination IP address of router B. B. Server B will generate a frame with the destination MAC address of switch B. C. Server B will generate a packet with the destination IP address of router A. D. 
server B will generate a frame with the destination MAC address of router B. E. Server B will generate a packet with the destination IP address of host A. F. Server B will generate a frame with the destination MAC address of router A. The answers are D. Server B will generate a frame with the destination MAC address of router B. And E. Server B will generate a packet with the destination IP address of host A. In order to send data to host A, Server B will generate a packet that contains the IP address of the destination device on the remote network and a frame that contains the MAC address of the default gateway device on the local network. Match the description to the organization. Not all options are used. The choices are ISOC, ISO, EIA, IANA. The answers are When IPv4 addressing is manually configured on a web server, which property of the IPv4 configuration identifies the network and host portion for an IPv4 address? The choices are A. DNS server address B. Subnet mask C. Default gateway D. DHCP server address The answer is B. Subnet mask Subnet mask determines the network address portion and host portion for an IPv4 address. Default Gateway, the IP address of the router interface used for communicating with hosts in another network. DNS Server Address, the IP address of the domain name system server. DHCP Server Address, is not configured manually on end devices. It will be provided by a DHCP server when an end device requests an IP address. What layer is responsible for routing messages through an internetwork in the TCP, IP model? The choices are A. Internet B. Transport C. Network access D. Session The answer is a. Internet. The TCP, IP model consists of four layers, application, transport, internet, and network access. Of these four layers, it is the internet layer that is responsible for routing messages. The session layer is not part of the TCP, IP model but is rather part of the OSI model. Which PDU format is used when bits are received from the network medium by the NIC of a host? The choices are A. File B. Frame C. Packet D. Segment The answer is B. Frame when received at the physical layer of a host, the bits are formatted into a frame at the data link layer. A packet is the PDU at the network layer. A segment is the PDU at the transport layer. A file is a data structure that may be used at the application layer.
which method allows a computer to react accordingly when it requests data from a server and the server takes too long to respond. The choices are A. Encapsulation B. Flow control C. Access method D. Response timeout The answer is D. Response timeout If a computer makes a request and does not hear a response within an acceptable amount of time, the computer assumes that no answer is coming and reacts accordingly. And that is the end of this video. Thank you for watching, and do watch our other videos. If you have not done it yet, please subscribe to the channel, to help us make more IT-related content. Thank you and see you in our next video.